is someone who actually did something that should cause every single one of us pause. In Todd Edelman's role on the D.C. Superior Court, he released a man who subsequently went on to participate in the murder of an 11-year-old child. And that child was murdered at a Stop the Violence July 4th cookout. At the time that Judge Edelman released this individual, he knew that the defendant had been arrested multiple times for illegally possessing a firearm. And he knew that the defendant had been previously seen shooting a gun in the street at 1 p.m. in broad daylight. And he knew that only a week before Judge Edelman decided to release this defendant, another judge had denied his release because he was a danger to the community. That judge would not let him out. He knew that releasing this defendant with a GPS ankle bracelet would not protect the community because he had already illegally fired a gun while he was on a GPS monitoring for a previous offense. Now, Judge Edelman knew every bit of this. He knew it. But he released this individual, and this individual went on to murder, to murder an 11-year-old at a Stop the Violence July 4th picnic. We talk about judgment. We talk about discernment. We question these individuals. This lack of judgment is absolutely despicable. This child is dead. And this individual, when I questioned him, did not provide sufficient explanation. He is unsuitable, in my opinion. I will be voting no.